Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews and today I've got another episode of What's for Breakfast and if you watched any of my reviews in the past you know that I like to have noodles for breakfast and I know they're probably not the most healthy thing in the world and certainly some of the cup of noodles and some of these other ones are a little bit high in the sodium but you know <laughs> I guess it you know, I, I usually have it for breakfast and I don't always drink all the broth or whatever and so it's not that bad. And I ran across this one. I thought I would uh, give it a try. I haven't seen this one. Well, I haven't tried this. I've seen it quite a few times and I, I almost forgot I had this one. I went to uh, Winco um, several months back and it was in the back of the cupboard and I kind of forgot about it. <laughs> I was like, surprise! <laughs> Digging through my cupboard and I'm like, oh, I forgot I had it. And this is by Nong Sim? Shim? Nong Shim? Boy, I can't say it. And this is premium noodle soup and this is Shin Black. Spicy pot a fu flavor. Pot a fu. Pot a fu. <laughs> <laughs> and okay so here's the bad news on this one 450 calories for the whole container and 1480 on the sodium so yes it is a little bit and the instructions say to open the lid halfway add all soup bases pour the hot water up to the line and close and wait for four minutes so Go ahead and open this up. I think there's going to be some packets in. Yes, there are. Uh -huh. Okay. Wow, this looks like it's got a lot of good stuff in it. There's um, dried mushrooms and vegetables. Two types of soup base. This is the soup base, and this is the. I guess this is the chili soup base spices I don't know but anyway it said to add all the stuff in there and I've got some water that I boiled up in my electric kettle and while this water's still hot I gotta hurry and add the add the spices to it and here we go Okay, that's like a powder and if you don't want much sodium you don't have to add these I guess you can add just regular hot water and then you could put like you know a little bit of soy sauce or a little bit of uh, just seasoning in it if you don't want the um, full flavor or you don't have to put the whole soup base packet in there you can put like half or you can put uh, just a couple sprinkles and uh, then you won't have so much uh, sodium that's another trick um, some of them that come already prepared, it's already added in. You can't control what uh, you put in there. So then I put that in there, and I've got the thing on here. So I fill this up to the line. Okay, yeah, there we go. That's hot. <laughs> Should have put it down. <laughs> so. I've got it filled up to the line. I'm going to wait for four minutes and I'll come back once it's all done and ready to go. And I don't think this is going to be spicy at all. And I got some hot sauce to um, add to it if I want. So stay tuned for about four minutes and I'll be back. Okay, guys, so it's been about four minutes and kind of. I'm just going to, I'm not going to use chopsticks on this one. I'm just going to use a fork. And here we go. It's, the noodles have kind of um, cooked up. They got soft. And it's very rich broth. I don't know. If, I 
I'm not sure if you're going to be able to see this or not. Let's see if I can... Let's see if I can tilt the camera. So there you go. There is the broth. It's nice and kind of rich and um, very... Um, it's not like thin. It's a very um, rich, dark color. Kind of a red or brownish, and that's a pata fu. I'm not really sure if that's I'm saying that right, but it's also got mushrooms and um, other items in there. And so there you go. Get a good look at it. <laughs> so, all right, all right, we're back. And this thing is hot. <laughs> Shouldn't be holding it. And I have a little bit of this hot sauce I picked up. It's called Texas Pete's. Hotter hot sauce. <laughs> they had two versions. One was like hot, one was hotter. If you know me, I like hot. <laughs> so I got the hotter version. This is actually cheap. It was like a dollar or fifty for this bottle. So and I've uh, made a pretty good dent in it. I usually put I usually put hot sauce in my cup of noodles or you know chili or something like that. Okay so now that this is kind of cooked up, well, I can really smell. It's like a real rich, like, it, I guess it's like a mushroomy kind of thing. Or, um, yeah, I'm not really sure what, how to describe that broth, but got the noodles. <laughs> and I'm going to try not to slurp them too bad, but I heard that it's um, bad manners if you don't slurp them. And you're also supposed to slurp them to get... The air circulating and get the flavor of them. So here we go. Try this one for you guys. Here we go. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, well, that's actually pretty good. It's peppery. Yeah, it's already got. Wow, it's already got spice in there. Like a very brothy, uh, peppery kind of. Um, flavor to it it's a little it is a little spicy and this is it, it did say spicy patafu so it's already sp patafu <laughs> it's already spicy so I don't know if I'm gonna need the hot sauce but here we go mm. the noodles are good here <clears throat> That does have a kick, I'm telling you, that broth. It's got peppers and mushrooms and all kinds of other stuff in there. It's kind of, whoa, it's lingering. And it's like a, like a pepper, like a peppercorn, like a, um, Tassie. <laughs> Tassie opened the door. <sighs> Photobomb, Tassie, why do you do this to me? He wants to get in my videos every time. Whenever I go live, whenever I do a video, he's there. He can get his own channel. <laughs> so anyway. Um, yeah, so here we go. I'm going to try it with some mushroom and a little more sauce here. Mm, very rich. That broth is actually really good. This is a little bit up from the cup of noodles or the... What's the other one? Um, Marichon. You know, the cheap 33 cents a piece or 50 cents a piece ones. This, I believe it was like a dollar fifty two dollars for this. But it is it is premium. So it says premium noodle soup. So it's a step up. You know, you're making a big money. You can afford to get, you know, your dollar cup of noodles. <laughs> but uh, one more try. Here we go. Mm. that's quite spicy I don't think I'm going to need any hot sauce in it the mushroom mm. that flavor comes across good it's really like a real meaty kind of brothy flavor that very rich very spicy already I mean wow I don't even know 
Now what the heck, I'm gonna just, I'll put in a few drops of this to see if that, <laughs> if I can handle it, I don't know. This is supposed to be hot sauce, so. Here we go. A little bit. And then I'll try to, I'll try the broth after that. <laughs> I might need crackers or bread to help with this. <laughs> It's like, whoa. All right. One more try. All right. Oh, wow. <laughs> Ooh. Man. <clears throat> yeah, that's a... This is definitely a wake you up in the morning type of breakfast. <laughs> um, if you could handle the sodium and you can handle the spice, um, I say recommend this one. I think they had other black label ones, but I'm not sure what the flavors were. I've seen them in the stores before, like in the Asian aisle. If you guys have a gr uh, grocery store and it's got like an Asian aisle where they have all the different uh, Ramens, all the different, uh, you know, Japanese th snacks, seafood, or it's not seafood, seaweed, um, you know, crackers, snack chips, drinks, all that kind of thing. This will probably be there. The Nongsim. I've actually tried some of their other ones, the Pho, they have the Pho, and the miso soup and different ones like that and they're in like a bowl but this is actually pretty good and it is very spicy even without the hot sauce so mm. yeah very hot i'm gonna try some of the broth <laughs> wish me luck folks see how hot it really is oh wow Oh yeah, that broth is very spicy. If uh, I think I needed some crackers or some bread to help with the, um, you know, but, but actually it's very good flavor. Good amount of heat, not like pull your head off spicy, but it is very spicy. I'm eating some burn. So this is actually really good, good flavor. Good value. Step up from regular cup of noodles, you know, the beef, the shrimp, the, they even have like hot chicken. You know, it's not the best flavors on those. So this is one step up. So for this one, the Nong Sim Shin Black Premium Noodle Soup, spicy patafu flavor. <laughs> Give that one nine out of 11. <laughs> pretty good even for cup of noodles so yeah if you want something a little bit different you just pay a little bit extra get a premium meal and it's really good so if you get them in your asian aisle or grocery store i think even walmart might have it target one of those places check them out like i said if you don't want the sodium don't add the whole packet or just add a little bit you know cut it back so that's my take on this one, and I'm gonna go ahead and um, hopefully be able to finish this whole thing. <laughs> so if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell right over there. That way you won't miss any future content or when I go live, and uh, you won't miss out on any of the fun. So until next time on Drew's Food Reviews, when I'll be trying something new for you out there, I'm gonna finish this one off for my breakfast and now that it's cooled down a little bit I can kind of eat it and not worry about burning myself so until next time I'll talk to you guys later and uh, cheers everybody <laughs> <laughs>